Good morning, Internet Explorers. It's day three of my Japanese adventure. I'm going to Tateyama, which is this big mountain, and right now we're taking a trolley bus to Kurobi Dam. Omizawa station and we're going to go all the way on the trolley car to here, Karobi Dam. Karobi Dam, sorry. That's my brother. I'm in line right now to go to go on the trolley. Here's my ticket. To get to Karobi Dam, it's only a 15 minute uh, train ride. You can stand or you can sit and since it's only 15 minutes, standing's not a, it's, it's fine. It's going to go through a tunnel so don't worry about the views because you're going through a tunnel. It's going to be dark. This is the model. It's 186th of the actual dam. They started building the dam in 1959 and they didn't finish until I think 1963. So it took four years to build this giant dam. It takes a long time. That's like a college degree. Baco? Yeah, Kuro Baco station right now and we're gonna take a trolley up to Mount Tateyama and unfortunately we'll not be taking the pleasure boat this time around. I wonder how pleasurable it is. This ride is slightly different than the previous one. It's still a cable car but this one has a really steep slope and it's just gonna keep on climbing. So we just got off the Karube stop. Um, don't confuse that with Karube Dam, that's two di different stops. This is the Karube viewpoint stand. I'm a little out of breath because I walked a lot of stairs. Another point for me to be here, not just to get my workout on and to enjoy the spectacular view, is because if you look behind me, there's a rope ray and a cable car that takes us all the way up to Mount Tateyama. That's where we're going up to next. So I need a little refreshment. A little refreshment. Black sesame ice cream. But it's really good. My brother's holding the camera, that's why I'm a little cropped out right now. So we went from here to here to there and then we rode the trolley bus all the way to here by Kanbo and now we have to take the Tateyama Tunnel trolley bus to Morodo. We started from Ogizawa and now we're here. What? All this is the Tateyama mountain range. Spinny, 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 spinny. No! In July! This wall of snow behind me, this is just the summer. Can you imagine how high it'll be during the winter month? It just piles. See, that's the station that we come, came from. That's also a restaurant and a hotel. So you can actually stay here overnight to enjoy this view. We're here in Hotel Tateyama. We're gonna walk around this area, but if you had more time, like if you were staying in Tateyama, you can walk all around here up the mountains. There's also campsites in case you wanted to stay overnight here. Anybody for a swim? Do you see those people with the orange backpacks? That's part of the Taiwan Mountaineering Group. They're walking back to Mount Fuji just from these mountains. Isn't that amazing? Does this remind anyone else of the sound of music? Yeah, bottle this up and sell it. 
it's so cold and refreshing. Save your empty bottle so you can refill it here. But if you don't have empty bottles, they also offer those little wooden paddles. See? And you can drink from those wooden paddles. Going on this bus for 15 minutes because we're going to the bottom of the mountain. Okay, guys. We're at Tateyama Station, which is our final stop, which is at the bottom of the mountain. And we're ready to go to our hotel now and call it a day. We went to a lot of places today, and I'm gonna say this is where I leave you. We see enough, and I'm gonna spend the rest of the day with my family. You know, have a little private moment because I've been filming the last three days. Um, I'll see you guys next time where I will show you my day four Japanese adventure. Oh yeah, there's more. All right, see you guys next time. Bye.